You ever see a guy having a heart attack on a harmonica, then dying? It would sound like this. <laughs> he is Ron Jeremy, everybody. Ron Jeremy, well-known actor, uh, uh, done a, a lot of adult entertainment and in the mainstream as well. Ron, thanks for joining us. Thank you. You know why I'm doing this, by the he, way? Tell me about the harmonica. Where does that come from? Because in? John Popper gave this to me as a gift. John Popper is probably the best harmonica player out now, really, in a band called Blues Traveler. And John Popper is coming to the Ponderosa Sun Club for the Nudes of Poppin' Miss Nude North America pageant this coming Sunday, uh, June 20th. Daytime show, uh, an hour and 20 minutes out of uh, Chicago. The Ponderosa is in Roselawn, Indiana, near Merrillville. My 28th year doing the show. I've had Kid Rock, I've had Corn, I've had Slash, I've had all the big stars. And now we got 6,000 people in the audience, nice. 100 naked girls on stage, and 20 guys competing for the ladies who want to watch. And that's the show. And I got my harmonica from John Popper. How, how is the talent that comes out there? Pretty good? They're gorgeous. You got the best dancers in the Midwest. They all come out to, uh, to win this award. They make money. And by winning the award, Miss New North America, Miss Runner-Up, Best Legs, Best This, Best That, they then get to feature dance, and they go from being a $1,000 a week house girl to a $1,000 a day feature because they won an important contest. Now, so it's a good deal for them, too. It, it's your way of giving back to the community, making the little starlets. Giving back to the community. I can hear the violins in the background. It's so special. <laughs> can we please join hands and sing We Are The World? <laughs> Nothing to do with giving back to the community. What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a, the girls, all the dancers from all over the country, they compete in, in Indiana because they want to get that award. Nice. Well, Ron, I was reading your book here, The Hardest Working Man in Show the Business. Joke, yes. Hardest Man in Show Business. Uh, this is me before the buffet. Uh, hey, you look great. We'll get shots. There you go. Yeah, a couple of years, maybe, uh, uh, back when the, the times were wild. And we'll get into those times now. But I read, read this part. This is the best thing on the whole book. What does it say? What up here? New York Times bestseller. Uh, sit slow and give it some feeling. New York Times bestseller. Oh, I love that. You know, you know, it's, <laughs> I was competing against Barack Obama books and Hillary Clinton books. It shows it what we a, want to read. All nonfiction, you know, all get lumped into one category. So if you need to be a bestseller, I was competing against them, so they, a lot of them are bestsellers too, you know. The first they thought Howard Stern was bad enough, and now you're beating them in their yeah, books. Same publishing company too, HarperCollins. You can't blame them. Yeah.